today's video is going to be a tutorial and I haven't done actually I did one of these like a month ago but I feel like these are becoming less and less popular on YouTube but I personally still like them if it weren't for these types of videos I wouldn't know how to do any makeup or hair so I like to still do one of these every now and then for you guys so I did a 4 everyday hairstyles video, basically just going through my favorite hairstyles that I get a lot of questions about like on Instagram and stuff. And um, I asked if you guys wanted to know how I curled my hair, which was kind of the base of all those hairstyles. And a lot of you said yes, so here is that video. So while you're here, be sure to put on my notifications so that way you know when I upload videos. I never see this in any of my videos and I feel like I should because it's kind of something you have to do now. So yeah. There's that, please do that <laughs> so you can watch my video. If you know me and have watched other videos on my channel, you'll probably know that I was obsessed with prom. And I actually went to three proms and I vlogged all of them. So this dates back to when I was like 16 years old. So uh, yeah, here are like some clips of really like throwbacks because I graduated three years ago. Yeah. what I'm trying to say is prom was always something very special to me I was never really involved in high school um, I was I didn't have a lot of friends in high school I'm gonna be upfront with you guys like I was very introverted I went to college for two years instead of being on campus at the high school just because I didn't care for it so prom was something I really looked forward to because I felt like that was really highlights for me in my high school experience since I really didn't do much else so when I heard of this uh, opportunity and campaign, I really wanted to get involved. So with that being said, for this video, I'm actually working with Youth and Consequences and the Princess Project. And if you don't know what either of those are, basically Youth and Consequences is a YouTube Red streaming series. So you can check it out here on YouTube Red. It's super interesting, but what's great about it is the cast is full of very just powerful, smart, funny women. and the whole theme is just women empowerment and they partnered up with the princess project so the princess project is basically really really amazing what they do is they collect donations of dresses accessories and they give away these things to girls that would maybe not have any other chance to get a dress or whatever it is they need for their dances or proms and I feel like for me personally those moments are super important and at that time it's not really about the clothes you're wearing but it's the confidence that you get when you're wearing them and that you can remember those days and just have a great time and not have to worry about whether or not you can afford a dress so that's why I'm so so happy to be kind of just spreading awareness about this and I hope that you guys can get involved so if you're interested in watching Youth and Consequences it's super super funny and it's just kind of a modern day twist on the high school experience so be sure to check out the link I'll include below where you can watch two free episodes and also if you're interested in getting involved with the Princess Project please do I'll also include everything you need to know in the description box below as well so yeah, um, but anyways, let's go ahead and get started with the hair tutorial. Alright, so first I'm just starting off with my natural hair. And you want to make sure that your hair is pretty dry if you do take a shower, just so that way the curls hold better. And I'm just applying some heat protectant, and this is by Form Beauty. And I'm using the new me Cone Wand, and this is part of the Lustrum set. And if you don't have this wand, a 25mm works really well for this as well. So I'm just taking about a 1.5 inch section of hair and just curling that around the wand and holding it for about 5-10 to 10 seconds, depending how thin your hair is. If your hair is pretty thin, you don't want to leave it on too long. Um, but if you have a lot of hair, obviously leave it on for a little bit longer. And then release it. And if you're going for that kind of beachy, wavy look, then you can kind of separate the pieces a little bit. If the 
strands or sections are too thick just so that way it has more texture and then I'm just continuing this on with the rest of my hair and if you have really long hair like me you might have to um, curl the top section of hair and then curl the bottom but if you don't have time it doesn't really matter so I went ahead and curled that half of my head and moving on to the other side repeating the same exact process and I like to curl my hair the same direction all throughout my hair um, you can alternate it but I personally just don't mind having it all in the same direction it's a little faster that way because then I can just repeat the same thing over and over so yeah I just curled all of my hair and right now I'm gonna kind of go throughout my hair and maybe separate some pieces and just make it the way I want it to look and then I'm applying some sea salt spray and this just creates even more texture which is perfect for um, the look I'm going for just that tousled look and I'm just scrunching up my hair just to get the product in and what I like to do is flip my hair back and forth it just makes it a lot more like volumized I don't know I always do this so now I'm adding some flexible hold hairspray just to hold everything into place but you don't want anything too uh, firm holding just so that your hair isn't crunchy but yeah that's basically how I curl my hair so I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. I hope that you found it to be helpful. Let me know in the comments what other videos you want to see me do. And be sure to follow me on Instagram as well. And yeah, hope you're having a wonderful day. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Love you. Bye.